What's good, team exclusive, and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content. Today, we are, as promised, we are doing the highest rated draft challenge today. Hopefully, we can uh, go about beating our highest rated draft at the moment. Shall I wait for me to look at the record? Um, I think currently, yeah, okay, so our team rating uh, at the moment is a 188. I don't believe we'd probably beat that. I, I don't know. I'd love to see. I, I'm pretty sure 190 is possible. I don't know if that's ever been achieved, but if it is, yeah, we could pick up a world record. And um, yeah, that'd be quite nice. I mean, it'd be very nice. It'd be very nice. Either way, that's our aim today is to try and beat our 188 challenge uh, or target. And then if we do, or if we get 188, I'll probably keep it and then we'll play with it for the next episode of Draft to Glory. And um, yeah, be big pimping. So none of these formations really appeal to me in the way of like highest rated players i guess that one because you've got right forwards and right wings and all that kind of stuff so we'll take it there's a chance of team of the year messi if he's still in draft which i believe he is what is that i'm not even recording my screen hold on i do apologize i did forget to change the screens what is that what is that um that's insane. That's ridiculous. Okay, so we're starting off. Okay, bit of a scuffed episode. You know, could do the intro again. Hey, oh, what's up? Let's go. Team of the year. How's your draft? Da, 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 da. Here we are. So, team of the year. Mbappe. Mbappe. All we need is Neymar. All we need is Neymar. I'm actually recording, aren't I? I am. That would be really sad. So, we are going to take... We'll take Sterling. It's the same rating as Mane, and Mane's got a better card, so... I think Sterling's got a better card as well. There is Messi, but we're going to take Di Maria for the chemistry and for the chance to get Team of the Year Messi. Marcus Rashford is very nice. Strong links to Sterling. Things you love to see. This could be... This could be... This could be a good draft. This could be a good draft. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, so we get Artur. Not really going to help us too much. We get Saul, who obviously does link to Thiago... Probably is the best shout. Um, there's probably more better La Liga centre backs that we could link to that would help us more than the other guy. So we'll take. Oh god, okay. Nobody really helps, so we'll just take that guy. Cool. So Artur would have been the shout. Good lord. Uh, we'll take Hummels just because he's higher rated. He can go on the bench, hopefully. Um. Centre back, middle centre back is Stone. Bonucci would have been the call, wouldn't he? But uh, we'll take Ogbonna. Got a very shiny head though. Nobody high rated, so it makes sense. Definitely makes sense. Come on, big goalkeeper. We don't get a big goalkeeper. Get cheeky Kalor Navas. Get a Handanovic. Uh, Courtois. I mean, I'm going to take Courtois just because I think there's more chance of us getting like Ramos, Varane, that kind of stuff. So. Um, yeah, wow, holy shit, holy shit. This is me. This is also me, not realising the hits would have strong linked to Hummels. F it's, just, it's just not the one, is it? There's literally no saving this draft. 82 for the 75. We've got a lot of stinker picks as well, it's crazy. Let's look at all these players that we got on the bench. Oh, we got him, him, Podence, Hits, Shell Felix... Not even the special versions. And then just Hummels, Goretzka, uh, Saiz. It's just crazy. And then Pedro Goncalves. It's crazy like, the amount of absolute stinkers we got in the draft. But yeah, he's just gonna, it's just going to be the best card in the game, probably. Best card in the game. But yeah, we'll, we'll go throw away this draft and we'll be back in two seconds. Onwards and onwards. So second draft, here we come. So we can do a little bit better than 1-8... Uh, 181, I believe it was. Was it? Yeah, must have been a 181. Um, anyway, so I don't know what kind of formations we actually need. What kind of players we're looking for. Obviously, team of the years, future stars are the most important things. So uh, right mid, left mid, and strikers we need. So I'm going to go with the 3 4 one, two. Kind of gives a bit of everything. A lot of everything we can get. We get a Falcao. Interesting. Um, Paolo Dybala. Put my cam. Great, we will. Uh, just this, a lot of icons and stuff you can get a cam. 
would have been nice, but Jesus Christ. I mean, we've got Letaro Martinez, strong links to uh, Dybala. So, can't complain with that. Can't complain with that. Hembe, we'll take Kim Pembe just for that possible link to um, cheeky little Kaylor Navas. You do love to see it. Second centre-back is Serbi Benucci Varan. It's going to have to be Varan, isn't it? Or was it actually? A, mm, I don't know. Probably wouldn't have worked either way. Um, so... Not ideal. Not ideal. Good lord. I'll take my... Uh, Hummels just sees the highest rated. Come on, let's see. Uh, Kaylor Navas. Or Courtois, actually. Courtois works. Somewhat. Um, we'll take him. It's a good high rated goalkeeper. At least he gets chemistry this time, which is very nice. And then, of course, it's a stinker. Of course it is. Um, if we get Sergio Ramos, that'd be nice. Oh, Robertson. I mean, it's either that or we take a really low rated player. So I'm going to take Robertson in the hopes that EA will bless me. It didn't, it didn't bless me. Um, either, although, although, Florenzi works to some degree. He does work, actually, yeah. I'll take him. Because if we do Bish Bash Bosh, that also gets more chemistry somehow. And then we put Florenzi in there. And he gets, wow, well, actually, I forgot he links to uh, Insigne. Big brain, big brain stuff. Before anybody jumps in the comments, um, yes, I, I know. I, I'm editing this and I want to punch myself in the face because I am such an idiot. A legend. Ooh, let's go. Look at that. Look at that card. Future Stars nominee, Reese James. Um, we also get a Drissa guy who actually would work, which is sad, but I don't care. Uh, I'm going to take... Nobody helps. Nobody helps. Do they? Nope. It doesn't matter about those because I'm not going to be playing with them. So they don't help for chemistry. They are nice looking cards and they are brand new cards. 98 pace for Anthony. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. But I'm going to have to take a Drissa guy. Am I? Am I really? It's going to get three more chemistry. Oh, I'm going to have to. Fuck it. I hate myself for that. I hate myself for that. But it is what it is. It is what it is. So we get Chala, Kalahala Noglu. Uh, we just get Mo Salah. Not ideal. Not ideal at all. I mean... We do have some Premier League vibes going on. Um, so Mo Salah could work. Kalahala Noglu. Kalahala, yes, glue. No, not really. I mean, he... Mm. I'm going to take Salah. He's, high, he's highest rated, and he only drops us one chemistry. You do love to see it. You do love to see it. A Premier League strike would be very nice. Nope, okay. But he could give us partial chemistry for now. Um, let's do that and put... Okay, never mind. He gives us one. Gives us one thingy in there. At least it gives us one chemistry, I guess. Um, okay, right. Kind of shaping up to be the same as the first draft, really. Not ideal, to be honest. Not ideal. Um, Willian could work. I'm going to take Willian just as a, a backup because of partying Willian. Ooh! <laughs> hey, we got uh, Team of the Year um, Neuer, who... I mean, he does work. Does work. But we've already got a 90 rated goalkeeper, so it doesn't really matter. Cristiano. Um, Artur Sadov is going to have to be Sadov, surely. I mean, Artur, yes, he would work. He is kind of that Syria centre mid we do need. Strong links to uh, Dybala. Uh, obviously, he gets a strong link. Um, links to Malinkovic Savic. Would link to Willian if we put him out on the left or on the right, sorry. Um, Cristiano, he is that City ass striker as well. Oh my god. See, if we put, yeah, I, Cristiano would work actually. He would work. Uh, but then also, 
how much chemistry would he give? So you'd give 10 to so he'd, plus 3. Yeah, he wouldn't because he'd still be off chemistry. We're going to have to take Cristiano. He's the only one that works properly. So he gets a plus 8, which is pretty big. Um, yeah. I, I hate myself for turning down the icon, but it's the only thing that really works. And I do want to see if this gives us more. We put in big boy Thomas Party. It doesn't. Okay, so it doesn't make any difference. We'll keep the highest rated in there. Um, what do we need? An icon <laughs> would be good. An icon would be very nice, but uh, actually, no, no, we don't need an icon because we can just do. Uh, I'm gonna take him just for chemistry if we need it, but we can just put Baradi in there. Does he not give us? That doesn't help at all. I thought that might help. Wow. Okay. Um. Yeah, no, we need an Italian striker, don't we, really? I could do... No. Hmm, okay, never mind. Well, I thought that might help, but obviously clearly it doesn't, so... We're at 89. I don't know what we really need to do to save this draft, to be honest. Fernando, we get Marcos Lorente. Jean-Victor... Jean-Felix Rebic... He wouldn't work. He wouldn't. He wouldn't help at all. Good lord. Yeah, really not getting the uh, getting the picks we need. Um, it's really just that kind of Florenzi, um, Pogba kind of situation. So, I'm gonna take the highest rated in Fernando. Put him on the bench as well. Not not amazing to be honest. Really not amazing. These drafts have really kind of just been a bit of a letdown. I'm being honest, but that could have just saved us. Could have just saved us. Um, obviously, we'll take Bernadeschi and put him. It didn't help at all. But actually, no, wait, no, don't lose hope. Don't lose hope just yet. And we'll take Baradi and we get 96 chemistry. Can we do anything to get any more chemistry? Don't think so. There's nothing we can really do. Yeah. So, I think that's probably as good as... If we can get a French French manager, City A manager, um, or Liga... Mm, no. Three, that'd be 99. If we get Zidane, that'd be perfect. French and La Liga. So, we'll put Paul Pogba on the bench. As per... Actually, no, wait, that's... Put him for him. And there we go. So, okay, so all we need is a bit of luck in the managerial, managerial selection. I mean, we've got Syria. 99. You can't, you can't be doing me like that, surely. It is what it is. There we are. So, unfortunately, a bit sad. Big sad. Um, we only got, I mean, it, it would only have been a 187 anyway, so it wouldn't have mattered regardless. But it's a bit sad we're only one off and we just, I don't know. I can't see the chemistry from anywhere. I've tried a lot of different options. Um... But yeah, it's just a case of, again, once again, we just didn't get the players we needed. Maybe that icon could have could have been the saviour and not choosing it may have been our downfall. But I don't know. I think overall, we've probably been a lot more screwed with that, that striker position than, um, than anything else. So I feel like that was the right choice. But who knows? Once again, I'm going to go throw this draft away and uh, we'll be back for the third and final draft. Good draft, to be fair. Good draft. Shame it sucks. Okay, so here we go for draft number three. What are we going to be called up with? Five at the back? No. Four, three, one, two. Not really. Could be an option, actually. Um, Could be an option. Just, I feel like... There's a lot of cam options. We'll take it. Why not? There's a lot of cam icons. A lot of cam team of the years. So we'll take it and we'll get a Shevchenko to start with. It's a very good, very good start. Ooh, yo. David Silva or Alejandro Alejandro Gomez. Uh, we'll take David Silva, just highest rated, obviously. Kind of the point of the challenge, to be honest. Um, we also get Gomez there. Now it's Sevilla. Would you believe it? Would you believe it? Unfortunately, you would because it's true. So, um, yeah, we'll take him. Obviously, nice um, uh, Liga Santander vibes going on. Very, very nice indeed. 
Unfortunately, it gets broken up by a very selfish Marco Royce. Vitzel. Ooh, yo. Big pools. Chiellini. CDM. Not ideal. Um, we'll take him. Uh, I'm just. I'm going to screw myself with too many leagues again. No doubt. Maybe not. We get Delaney as well. Very nice link to... Um, what's his face? And then we get Team of the Year. Alexander Arnold. And also Future Stars Dest as well. I do want to have a look at this card. It's a very nice right back. I really would like it for my team. Shame he's a lot of money. Um, but he's got good passing. He's got good dribbling. Good defending. And good physicals. As well as very good pace. I mean, kind of what you need is a centre right back, isn't it? But then Trent has literally nothing that appeals to me at all. I mean, unreal, but we'll take him anyway. Van Dyke would be nice, please. No? Okay. Didn't want them anyway. Um, who would... Chiellini? Jesus. I mean, it's really just like scraping the bottom of the barrel at this point. Take Skriniar. Highest rated and just work somewhat. Uh, Hinteregger? I guess that's the only option, really. Handanovic would be a nice nice pick. Thank you very much, EA Sports. Okay. Estupina. Estupinan? Estupinan. Estupinan. Okay. Um, I mean, yeah, but also no. We get Robertson, which is also, yeah, but no. Alexandro, which is yeah, but yeah. Um, I want to take Robertson because he's higher rated, but I'm going to take Sandro because he's chemistry. Because chemistry has been the only thing that's really been screwing me the entire time. Do get Bundesliga one. Um, we'll have to take it. It's our only option, really. Got no other goalkeepers at work, so we'll take it. Get Robertson back again as the 87 version. Um, would he be the smart pick? I guess he would. Yeah, if we can get like a right back Bundesliga player, please, that'd be great. Okay, wow. Okay, well, we uh, unfortunately got stiffed by the the shite picks. Like, what is that, man? What is that? Again, just not not being given the players we need. I just wonder if uh, something like this would give us more chemistry. If we don't have like the centre mid or anything there to actually help us with the chemistry. It's just, it's just a bit bad. It's just a bit terrible. Well, uh, that sucked. So, yeah. Uh, unreal. Unreal. We don't even get a manager that could even possibly help us. 90, 90, 90, 90, 91. Hey, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, Hinteregger. 91 rating. Wow, that actually stunk. I mean, it started off so well. I mean, actually, it didn't really, did it? It started off really poorly and just continued to be really poor. Right, the whole thing, just not getting the players we need once again. But I'm going to throw away the draft. I'm going to do another one because I want to end on like a 100 rated draft. Well, 100 chemistry rated draft. It's got, he's got a good team as well. Shame, it sucks. Online draft number four. Let's go. I did want to do three, but we're going to do four because... I want to have 100 chemistry in a draft. 433. That's going to make it very easy to build a hybrid. Not a hybrid, sorry. A um, full chemistry team. So we're going to do that. Falcao, if you could just fuck off. Lewandowski, let's go. 98 rated, but we're going to take Anthony instead. Of course not. Of course not. Come on. Let's see. Big player. Uh, oh, wow. Okay. A few choices here, actually, to be fair. Insigne. Good player, could work. Sterling, I mean, he's not he, okay. He is a good player. Um, Griezmann, it's gonna have to be Sterling, isn't it? He's highest rated. Bundesliga, please. Bundesliga, no. <laughs> oh dear. Messi, we'll take Messi. I mean, it's not a bad starting lineup. Got a few options. Got a few options to work with. So we'll take uh we'll take him, swap him over to Messi's side, could help us a little bit. Who am I looking for? So wow, we're not really getting 
that many ideal players. So we'll take Kovacic, swap those over, a bit more chemistry. If we get like Goretzka, that'd be good. Oof, yo, you love to see it. I'm sorry, all of those future stars are blinding my eyes. Wow, okay, you've never seen that many before. <laughs> Three in one pick. Harvey Barnes. It's, I'm not going to make the joke. It's fucking annoying. Uh, Anthony would love to pick him. Would love to. But he's not He's not going to be the one. Oscar, stinker. He is a future stars, but we are going to take Rivaldo. It's going to sort out a lot of chemistry problems that we possibly could have. Um, and just all round bit of a beast. So you love to see it. Why could we not get like a Premier League left back? Why? Why? Um... We'll take Kamada. I think there's a few more possible links that he could get. Laporte, Varane would be exactly that. But um, is that a problem again of just like everybody being on low chemistry? So it's going to have to be. He works the best, to be fair. And also, you know, we're only at the starting eleven just yet. Ooh, Ruben Diaz. We're getting so many future stars. We've seen so many in this. I could have taken Harvey Barnes, actually, to be fair. He would have strong link to uh, Sterling, but it doesn't matter. Get Ruben Diaz. Very nice player. But we also get Sergio Ramos, who is a very... He's got a nice beard. Anyway, we'll take him. And then hopefully we'll pick up a Courtois in net, which would sort us out. We do get the Barcelona version of Nelson Semedo. Who is obviously going to have to be the one who works perfectly. So we've seen so many insane players. And then Courtois obviously adding it off. And we do pick up that 100 chemistry. Very, very nice. Uh, things you love to see. There we go. So all we need now is just high rated players. Which of course we're not going to get. Um, Kone. Who looks like a bit of a cone. Van Dijk. Oh, yo, okay. 90 rated big boy Van Dijk. Um, not that he would work. Get Rodri, who would work. He would work very, very well. Not only would he go in there strong link to... What's his face? Oh. Okay, I thought that might give us more chemistry, but... Hey, oh, there we go. So, 100 chemistry. <laughs> Let's go. I actually don't mind that, to be fair. Do not mind that. Wow. Okay. It's going to have to be, isn't it? It's going to have to be. I mean, he's 90 rated, so... Whichever way you look at it, I mean, he's going on the, uh, I just wonder if that would give us 98. I do like that. That's, that's kind of okay, to be honest. It's kind of okay. At least we've got the option there to go back to the, you know, the 100 chemistry if we need it. But I'm pretty sure we shouldn't. These picks are, are awful, man. These are so bad. Like, what card is that? Tevez. Commendable Libertadores, man of the match. Okay. It's actually not a bad looking card in Venice. It's got good shooting. Pretty much about it. Anyway, we'll take Bernardo Silva. He actually could work as well. Not that it would have replaced Messi. Um, Fernando Torres or, or Yazabal. Take him for the bench. And Igalo. Okay, cool. I guess. Come on, let's see one more big pull. Mo Salah. Okay, I guess that is a big pull. Um, 90 rated. We also get Di Maria Griezmann. We get Jao Cancelo. Uh, we'll, take, we'll take Griezmann. Stick him on the bench. Uh, things you do love to see. Put him on the bench as well. Mo Salah as well. What's that putting up? 1 8. Wow. Okay. So we're up to the 1 8 9. I actually didn't think it would be that high, to be honest. That's crazy. Is it that crazy? I don't know. But we do get the 100 chemistry. Come on, please. Really? We don't get the 100 chemistry with that. Okay, well, I mean... It's typical, isn't it, really? To be honest, it's typical. Um, there's got to be... Oops, whoops, hold on. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Okay, right. Surely if we put... Uh... Well, would that lower the chemistry... Or the, the rating, sorry. It wouldn't. Okay, so... But then we don't get the 100 chemistry anyway. We really needed like a Premier League um, Premier League left back. 
which we just didn't get. So that is the 100 chemistry 190 rating. Um, I don't know, to be fair. I don't know what's better, to be honest, because obviously we're playing with Rakitic uh, and Rodri. Not the best, not the worst. And obviously Van Dijk at left back. But uh, would I rather just have, you know, one less chemistry and do and do that? It's probably what I'll do when we actually go to play with this team. It's probably what I'll do. But you know, it's not it's not even that great of a team, to be honest. But it is our highest rated team. So that is kind of the point of the challenge. And we have managed to do it. So, yeah. But that's probably what I'll do when we actually go to play with the team. I'll just put Kimmich there um, and have, you know, have that kind of set up. Even though, it's, I don't know if that's even better, to be honest. It's a bit of a woeful draft regardless, but it is our highest rated team. We have got the 19, wait, 189, uh, 189 rating. So things you do love to see. There we are. And that should hopefully have taken our, uh, our rating up. Best team score should have changed. Should have changed. Come on. Why is it not show? We got the one eight one 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 eight nine. But EA Sports, it says it right there. We got the one eight nine. We did it. Why are you not saying we did it? Either way, I had a lot of fun today. I had a lot of fun. Hopefully, you've enjoyed this video as well. Um, it's it's quite a nice different tone than you know, playing the draft, which is moderately stressful as it is, uh, or playing rivals, which is. You know, okay, moderately stressful as well, even though the last episode was an absolute banger. Cheeky plug. If you haven't seen it, do go check it out. Some absolutely insane goals um, with our brand new 88 um, Team of the Tournament Erling Haaland. So it's really worth checking out some very, very good, good, uh, good goals and some really nice FIFA as well. So well worth checking out. Either way, hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Um, I know it's something a little different, but hopefully you do enjoy it nonetheless. Um, and yeah. If you did, please do drop it a like. That'd be very, very much appreciated. If we see more of this content um, or any other content we produce in the future on this channel, then do consider hitting that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family. But with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, we'll see you next time.